excited about it. You see, Naomi Ryber, I know you're busy. I'm up to the third Phalorn book, Return of the Thorn Maiden. Are you now? Man, you're like the only person I know who's reading my books. The reason I asked about Phil is because he talks about the inner earth wars, which is a major feature of your books. Naomi, don't give up too many secrets around here. Yes. I wrote I wrote the Phalorn. They're all published on Amazon. I wrote the Phalorn books because I believe that, that for the same exact reason why the story of Jesus is very spiritually beneficial to us. It's, I don't know, I really wish you wouldn't mention that. But sometimes the best way to bring people to the truth is through lies. And I know that sounds sinister, but it happens every single day. Every single day that you're alive, you automatically edit out information that's, that's around you because it came to you too straightforward. But when it comes to you as deceit, when, when elements are brought to you and you realize, well, this is BS, and that's not happening, you instantly come to the truth by some type of analytical procedure that you that you yourself engaged in. So yes, Naomi, I did. I wrote a series of fantasy books. And you can say, you can tell people in the comment section uh, if you like them or not, uh, they passed them around the prison like it was number one New York Times bestseller. Uh, but I'm a... Uh, I don't get any reviews for those books. I don't get, like I said, my books are on Amazon. I'm under attack. I believe it's probably the same group of people, but they're leaving a lot of negative reviews and they don't even, many of the reviews don't even have anything to do with the actual book that they would put a review on. So I'm, uh, I'm seriously considering either removing all my books from Amazon and just, I might take Patrick's advice and render them into PDF files, make them either free to the public or I don't know, charge a nominal fee, just something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I have so much to do. It's just, uh, I get bogged down. So, but yeah, I, I wanted to write a series of books in fiction. It's a fantasy world, but it's a dark fantasy world. It's a race of fairies that are going through some really, really unusual, usual times. And all the interrelationships of all the different types of fairies. And, and as you know, Naomi, I, I saw your own third book, so you already know. They have a very rich history. And I spent a lot of time building a world it's very similar to ours and what I reveal in the fiction books I can never get in trouble for so I'll just leave it at that